Welcome to the Missing 1s and 10s. In this lesson I'm learning to solve problems like 45 plus something equals 67, which do not involve renaming. Well you can see down here I've got 32 blocks, but I want to have 45, so I'm thinking 32 plus what amount will get me up to 45. And you can see that this 32 I've got here is made up of 3 tens and 2 ones. So I'm going to start by looking at the ones. I've got 2 ones and I need to have 5 ones. So I'm thinking 2 plus what amount would get me 5? And I know the answer to that is 3. But let's just check that with the materials. So if I go down a little bit, you can see that I've got some more ones down here. I'm going to add in three. So there goes one, there goes my second one, and there goes my third one. And you can see that we were right. Two plus three does equal five. Now I'm going to move on to the tens. The question says I've got three tens, and you can see those three tens here, but I need to have four tens. So I'm thinking to myself, 30 plus what equals 40? Well I know 30 plus 10 equals 40, but let's just check that with the materials. So I'm going to move one ten up to there, and you can see we were right. We've now got four tens. So let's just go up a little bit and see what we've got here. We needed to have four tens or 40, and you can see I've got that amount here. And we needed to have five ones, and you can see I've got that amount there. Now to do that, we had to add in three ones and a 10. That means in total, we added in 13. You can see how this 13 here is made up of three ones and the 10. Let's try another question. Uh, this time I've got 13, which you can see here. It's made up of three ones and one 10. And I want to end up with 37. So I'm thinking 13 plus what will get to me to 37? Well, just like last time, I'm going to start with my ones. I can see I've got three ones, and you can see that over here, and I want to end up with seven. So I'm thinking to myself, three plus what will get me seven? Well, I know three plus four equals seven. But let's just check that using some materials as well. So I'm adding up four ones. There goes one two, three, and four. And you can see that we were right. Three plus four equals seven. And over here, I've got seven ones. Right, let's go back up to the tens. Here, I've got one ten, and you can see that down here. And I need to have three tens, or thirty. So I'm thinking to myself, ten plus what will give me thirty? Now I know that 10 plus 20 equals 30, but let's just check that with the materials as well. So if I go down here, I'm going to bring up one 10 and another 10, so I'm bringing up 20. And you can see we were right here as well. 10 plus 20 equals 30. So let's just check. We had to end up with 37. Well, here's our 30. And here is our 7. So let's check what we added in uh, to get to 37. Well, you can see over here we had to add in 4 ones and 20. So if I combine these two amounts, 20 plus 4, that's 24. So 13 plus 24 equals 37. Now let's try a question that doesn't involve uh, any materials. Uh, this time we've got 27 blocks, and I want to end up with 89. So I'm thinking to myself, 29, 27 plus how much will lead me to 89? Well, just like in the last examples, I'm going to start with the ones. So I've got 7 here, 
and I want to end up with 9. So I'm thinking 7 plus what will equal 9? And I know that the answer to that is 2. 7 plus 2. Now I'm going to move over here to the tens. I've got two tens and I want to end up with eight tens or eighty. So I'm thinking to myself, twenty plus what will lead me to eighty? And I know that twenty plus sixty equals eighty. So now we just need to see how much we added. You can see here we needed to add a two. Here we added 60. So in total we added 62. So 27 plus 62 equals 89. Let's just try one last example. Uh, this time I've got 54 and I want to end up with uh, 77. So I'm thinking 54 plus what will lead me to 77? Well, let's start with the ones again. You can see I've got four ones, and I'm thinking, how much do I need to add to get to seven? So I can record that like this. Four plus what equals seven? And I know the answer to that is three. Four plus three equals seven. Right, let's go over to the tens now. So here I've got five tens, and here I've got seven tens. So I'm thinking, 50 plus what will get me to 70. And I know that 50 plus 20 equals 70. So now we just need to look at how much we added. We added three ones and we added two tens or 20. So now I need to combine these two amounts. 20 plus 3 equals 23. So 54 plus 23 equals 77. Well, I hope you found this lesson helpful. For more help, check out teachertools.co.nz.